It's utterly heartbreaking what's happening in our country because of far left extremists. And there's been a lot of really depressing events that have taken place over recent days. One of the worst things to happen yesterday was when that statue in Bristol came down. It was a statue of a 17th century slave trader, Edward Colston. And I say this without any fondness or knowledge of the man before yesterday. But the message that it sends out is that you can circumvent the ballot box, that the mob can disregard democracy and the rule of law to achieve whatever it is they like, all as our officers stand by and watch them do it, too scared to act for fear of offending contemporary political correctness. There are reports that there was arguments over the removal of this statue. It was a highly contested issue in Bristol among elected councillors. So what entitles that mob to bring that process to an end on their terms? I think this is a terrible mistake by our police to turn a blind eye to it. The senior officer seemed to be admitting that the rule of law is selectively applied. Once you substitute the rule of the mob for the rule of the law, which is a key pillar of our democratic nation, you lose it. Politicians commenting on this have argued that they'll never condone vandalism and then they go on to do just that by making excuses for the criminal damage. It's this radical left cultural Marxism that's concluded that virtually no one that lived before us was a good person and yet have to have been an incredibly brave person to have the moral courage to reject society-wide ideas around sex and race back in the 17th century. It's just so unconscionably stupid. And what other statues are gonna be next? Gandhi standing in Parliament Square, he said some pretty sketchy things about black people. If you take down everything that you despise about our history, and my God, there seems to be a lot of it, then memory fades and you're destined to repeat it. We need to get a grip of this lawlessness. We need our politicians to find the backbone and stand up to this fake culture war. They should put back that statue and cherish the key pillars of our society, the rule of law and democracy.